Welcome to Pinball Mayhem. My name's Jeremy, and this is The Champion Pub. Now that the official name's out of the way, I'm going to refer to it as Champion Pub, like everybody else does. As you can tell from the name of the video, this is just a basics video, uh, something for the casual player. So if you're out at the bar or barcade or somebody's collection, you'll have an idea how to play this and get some enjoyment out of it because it's a lot of fun. It's I've had it for a couple of years. It's really popular at my parties. And uh, once a person knows how to play it, they just have a blast. Thank you very much for watching. Let's get started. Okay, here we are at my lovely champion pub. The object of the game is to defeat five boxers and win the title of pub champion. On the front of the game, of course, we got our start button. Coin door, no big surprise there. No uh, shooter over here. We just got the button to launch the ball. And on this game, you hold the button in when you want to launch the ball. You hold it in, and then the display goes like this. And when you let the button go, the you will get the prize uh, that it that it says. So there is a little timing trick there. And depending which prize you select, um, it also can determine where the ball ends up going after you let go of the button. So, ball launchers. We got a little scooper here scooper kicks it up into this wire form sends it all the way up here and around going to a tour of the play field um what else do we got we'll uh we'll count the shots here there's really five shots it says seven in the book if you count the two ramps it's seven but it's i kind of count it as five starting over here We've got the corner. That is one of the shots you can use. You can uh, start a fight. Uh, that's what I use it for the most time. There is some other things that we'll get into in the other deep dive video, what you can do for this. We've got the left jab. This has a special mechanism on it. Uh, when it's down, the ball comes up and around. And when it's up, the ball can go under it. Okay, the ball will go up and around here during normal gameplay. If you're not in multi-ball, it'll go up, hit the post, come back down and land in the saucer there or the vertical up kicker and it'll pop it onto the jump rope area if you're in multi-ball the post stays down and that's the only time it'll go all the way around kind of catches me off guard most of the time same goes with the other direction all right as we continue along in this direction we got the balcony the game calls it the stairs because when you go down the in lane here the coach will usually say climb the stairs kid and so you go up here and during normal gameplay if the speed bag is ready to go this gate will lift up as soon as you go up the ramp and it'll go into the this area here if this is turned off uh, as in you've already gotten what you can get out of it um, this will stay down and it'll come back down around here to the in lane and of course we've got the speed bag, uh, center shot, right ramp, left ramp, hit this, there's a switch in here. On the right, we've got the right jab, it's got the same kind of mechanism on it. So when this area is closed off by the game, the, it'll, it'll come up and back around. Otherwise, when you shoot it up here normally, there's a post in the back, it'll stop, come back down and land in the ball lock and you'll get uh, a locked ball. During a uh, multi-ball, it'll go up and around which will really throw you off. I'll just turn the boxer around here and I'll just show you him real quick. Here is the boxer. Uh, he's a pretty cool guy actually. We got, um, there's a switch in his head here. So if you hit, if he's in the fighting pose and you hit it up the ramp and you hit the ball on his face, it basically counts as two points uh, to knock him down more on the health bar. And then he's got the main gut shot here that's more usually one point. He's also got each arm as its own solenoid. So he will alternate between these. And it's pretty cool because he can kind of actually block it. And when you're fighting, he will pivot left and right. And uh, it's, it's a really cool mechanism. Very well designed. Okay, and one of the most important things on the play field to help you with the game is the life bars. This is your health this is your opponent's health to build our life bar in order to start a fight 
We've got the jump rope we can use, the speed bag we can use, or the heavy bag we can use. Then the start fight lights will come on and you can start the fight. Boxer turns around. To win a fight, you have to get his health all the way down. If you get his health down, you win. If he gets your health down, you lose. But you can also still keep your ball. If your ball's in play and he just keeps punching you, you'll lose the fight. But you'll still keep your ball and you have to build the health back up. And that's pretty much it.